This is a monarch butterfly. Butterflies and moths belong to the order Lepidoptera. Monarchs depend on milkweeds because they are the only plants that monarch caterpillars can eat. The adult butterflies drink the nectar of flowers. The monarch butterfly contains milkweed poisons that it ate when it was still a caterpillar. The monarch is the only butterfly that migrates for very long distances, like some birds do. During the fall migration, sugars from nectar are stored as fat in the butterfly's abdomen. This fat is necessary fuel for the butterflies to complete their migration and overwinter successfully. The monarchs that emerge in September and early October are the migrants. They will live six to eight months. Because they are the great-grandchildren of the butterflies that flew north the previous spring, they have never been to the overwintering sites in California or central Mexico. And yet, somehow, they find their way, probably through an inherited behavior pattern. The monarch's overwintering sites in the forests of the mountain ranges in central Mexico are about 10,000 feet, or 3,000 meters, above sea level. The tall trees make a thick canopy, helping to protect the monarchs from wind, snow, rain, or hail. Fog and clouds settle on the trees and provide moisture. To conserve energy, the butterflies cluster on trees where the temperature is just above freezing. They cover whole tree trunks and branches. Hundreds of millions of butterflies can overwinter in Mexico in one year. On the forest floor, the butterflies find nectar sources among the flowering plants. On sunny days, the butterflies often warm up enough to fly to nearby creeks and puddles where they drink water. Monarchs begin mating as the weather warms in the spring. By early March, they fly back north in masses. The females must find early sprouts of milkweed on which to lay their eggs. <laughs>